turn that frown upside down. <laughs> Welcome to day 17, y'all. I'm depressed at the world today, and Will came to make me feel better, and then he told me to turn my frown upside down. <laughs> and then I got cussed out again. <laughs> I wanna punch you in the fucking head. Okay, does anybody else feel the way that if no. like, you're in a negative mood and somebody comes up to you and goes, turn that frown upside down, does that not bother you? It's like, okay, thank you. Now that you've told me that I should smile, but I also, feel much better. also, keep in mind that I drove, what, 40 minutes here? to make sure that you weren't gonna like completely hate your life today. Yeah, so, but I, I was fine until you said, turn that phone. No, you weren't fine down. because you were pouting and, and I was sulking. not pouting, I was telling you my problems and she you were pouting. saying, and you were saying, oh, just got you a supervisor. Oh, if you just talk to your supervisor. But like, I don't wanna do that, that because then she's gonna know it's me. Yeah, okay, because if I go complain about somebody, I'm the only other worker, so if, she gets pulled into the office to get talked to. Okay, these two only work together. There's no other person in the room. That's what yeah. she's saying. So if she gets pulled in to get talked to, I'm literally the only person who could have said something. And then it's just going to be awkward. Okay, but you don't she's like gonna confrontation. She's going to be angry. That's why you won't. But then it's just going to make the rest of the year terrible. And then I'm going to be fired anyways. You're not going to be fired. I'm going to be let go anyways. Because so. you have to go to school to get your ECE license degree thing that still means that i'm not going to be able to work therefore okay but not able to and fired and let go are two different things they're gonna say okay you need to quit which means i'm getting let go which is basically fired no it's not <laughs> yes, fired it looks is. bad on a resume let go means that you went to school to better yourself that's not what let go means but okay turn that frown upside down <laughs> but we're gonna don't fucking touch me <laughs> We're, I will literally kill you. See how she treats me and she says, I'm respectful to my boyfriend. Do you want me to tell them what you were just doing? No, that's okay. Exactly. <laughs> I got more presents too. I got chocolate and A thing that Tim says, Hortons. I heart you? Yeah, a little Play-Doh thing, look. It's cute. Wait. It's in the bottom of the bag. Chocolate from one of the kids. And then this has like a prepaid visa in there. Oh, that's kind of nice. This These one kids has... are doing better than I am for your Christmas presents. <laughs> It's their parents. They're four and five. They're so. giving it to you. It's the kids. They take credit. And then this one's Tim Hortons. And then the little... Tim what? Tim Hortons. And a little heart. I think it's Play-Doh. But it's honestly... It's not Play-Doh. But touch it. It's, it's foam. I know. I touched it's it. It's not foam. It's like... That definitely is not handmade. Yes, it is. No way. That's literally handmade. Leave a comment down it in is. the comment section. It's squishy. Show them better. It's like my stress ball. But then you're going to ruin it. Scrush. Scrush. We're gonna go watch a movie or something so that he can stop talking. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Literally haven't said anything for like the last 40 seconds. A minute 40 actually. 42, 43, 44. Bye. <laughs>
and then we might extend our Christmas break two more weeks, which would benefit me, so I'm excited for that. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much all that happened today. We decorated the tree. There you go. And um, yeah, but we're gonna go and get chocolate chips. Uh, oh, I saw Dixie again today. Yes. He came in the truck. <laughs> Dixie was a she. Dixie is a girl, but I call him a he because every he, single time. Because she looks like a he. He is a boy. I don't care. Dixie, Dixie is a still boy. looks like a gremlin. And she's so cute. But I get to pet sit her tomorrow, and I'm so excited. Tomorrow? Yeah, tomorrow. It starts tomorrow? Yeah. 18th to the 21st. Tomorrow's the 18th? Correct. Holy cow. Yes. Wow. 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 This is only me for running out. Get in, Mom. I know. Get extra because we're going to be in lockdown. Get an extra just in case. Extra, extra. Okay, my turn. Yeah. Hey, you brought me along. This is your fault. <laughs> <laughs> that is what she did. But it's okay because now we have more and more excess more chocolate. Like I said, I usually don't cook with much. I don't usually cook with. Milk chocolate? But we're good now. And I know you're all dying to know what I chose. I would like to point out, <laughs> I chose something different and my mom told me to put it back. No, I didn't. Because I already have it. it. Yeah, I chose caramel M&Ms and mom was like, you already have those in your room, which she is not wrong. But I panicked and didn't know what to get. And who, who panics buying candy? Me, there's a lot of options. So, so what did the girls say when you were there? Okay, I haven't finished my sorry, story. I'm sorry. God! So, I chose macaroons, which is just chocolate and coconut. But anyways, the story my mother was talking about is there were these two girls working there, and the one girl came out from the back carrying a little mop, and she goes to the other girl, she goes, Man, we're so high! And I thought it was funny. And yep, that's my story. Anyways, I'm gonna go hang up these two ornaments on my Christmas tree. And then, continue watching Superstore. High quality ornaments right there. Yeah. That's good. Say goodbye to Vlogmas. Bye Vlogmas. Bye Vlogmas. Bye.